Yo, so it's 6.45 in the morning. Um, obviously, they say practice makes perfect. I say practice makes progress. And the only way I'm going to get better or more comfortable or whatever the case with vlogging is to obviously do it more. So um, it's Tuesday. Going to go get shots up with Bronson. I think he goes like maybe three, four times a week. I'm going two times a week just because um, in L.A. there's a lot of... Um, COVID spikes and you know things like that and it just seemed like no matter what you do you can still catch it so I'm trying to move as cautiously as possible but kind of keep some kind of normalcy I don't even know if that's a word or if I'm using it right but um, try to keep some kind of normal dynamic to my life or whatever and um, yeah so I'm gonna get shots up two times a week and today's day number one so let's go So I was supposed to check in with y'all a long time ago because I started this vlog at 6.45 this morning if y'all remember that last check in. I just kind of been running around then stopped home, hopped on the game with the homies and all of that. I would take the mask off but I'm we in between like Venice and, uh, and Santa Monica and it's just like a lot of traffic and people. So gotta stay safe so hopefully y'all can hear me with the mask on but I'm out here with my guy Darius, y'all can see him in the back, and then you can see Karina right here in the back, which is his girlfriend. But we just came out here to like, just chill and like get a little bit of content or whatever. So I figured I'd just pull the camera out and vlog a little bit, but um, I'm not entirely sure what's happening, but I'll check in with y'all later on, yo. Don't you take your back in, I'm telling you. Them people are dead today. Cause they took the shot off, it's okay. You take a shot, you won't get the virus. It won't kill you. That's what killed me. I'm telling you. So I, hold All right. So as you can see by the title, man, my truck got towed. So obviously you didn't already seen what happened leading up to this point. So the short version of the story is we set out to go to Venice or whatever. We park and at this place, there's only one sign and it's at the, at the corner. But the way that I ended up getting the parking spot was I came before that corner and I made a U-turn and then I parked. So the, no parking was from three to seven, but I'm sure, very sure that we got there after three o'clock. So that was the puzzling part. But there was at least like eight cars parked on this strip. So we park, we get out and we get a little ways to the walk, through the walk. And I'm like, yo, I forgot my wallet. I'm, you know, just like, damn, like if I wanted to buy a piece of pizza or some ice cream or something, like I forgot my wallet. So, you know, we're just walking and, you know, vlogging, doing whatever, getting just getting content, right? We decide to turn around and come back because it's starting to get dark. So I get this last shot that you see at the end of the vlog and I turn around and there's these two people at the corner and they're kind of like surprised, just kind of standing at the corner. And I'm wondering like, why are they not crossing the street? So I look down the street and there's, you know, a couple other people, they got a kid and they're kind of standing there with that same surprise look. So now I look past them and I look across the street and there's no cars over there. So I'm like, I didn't park right here. Like I parked, I'm pretty sure I parked further down the street. Darius is like, nah, yo, like you parked right here. They told you. 
and now you know at that moment it's starting to starting to register like oh i got told so then now the street that we walk down is it just so happens that the sign is at that corner so now i can see the sign that i didn't see prior and yeah so i got told um you know my mind's racing i'm trying to figure out like who to call and how to get my my truck back to where it doesn't have to stay overnight and then at the I don't, I don't remember what time this was but i'm just worried that like okay damn they're probably gonna be closed you know nine to five but i'm not gonna be able to get it today and it's gonna cost me a lot more to get it out so short story even shorter there is end up calling 911 they transferred us to non-emergency found out what my truck was i had to go i had to make three different trips i had to go get take a lift to the tow yard to get my truck then i had to take a lift to go pay for the truck because i couldn't pay for it at the place where my truck was then we had to take an uber back to the place where my truck was to get the truck out it was it was a headache um it definitely ruined the vibe of the day i mean you know to say the least but it is what it is and next time i just pay for parking <laughs> you know like that literally cost me 300 bucks to pay for parking so not even including like the lifts and the uber and you know whatnot so it cost me 300 dollars to park Next time I just go ahead and pay the 15, 20 bucks and pay for parking. But um, if you like the video, you like the vlog, drop it a like. Consider hitting that subscribe button, man. Y'all stay creative and I'll catch you in the next vlog.